Good morning. It's day eight of Vlogoween, um, and I'm in the woods. <laughs> I feel kind of weird being really loud in here. I don't know. There's like people hiking around. Um, but anyway, so I thought I would take a little walk in the morning before getting started with my Saturday chores, and I am here in this little like camp area. Um, I know about this place because we've used it for like field trips from the YMCA sometimes. <laughs> um, and we've had like like environmental education workshops for kids here. But it's pretty accessible and I just like coming here on the weekends when I know there's not gonna be kids here. And then since I have no work to do this weekend, which, oh, I can't even, can't believe that that's like my real life right now. Everyone is going to Fleet Week right now, so it's packed. So I'm probably not gonna go grocery shopping today. Probably wait that out and go tomorrow instead. Um, I'm probably just gonna make myself a pizza because why not? Uh, so I'm gonna make myself a pizza, drink some tea, light some candles, paint my nails, watch Charmed, wear my cozy robe, the works. I'm here to read this book, which is my October book that I'm reading. Um, it's called Nutshell, as you can see, by Ian McEwan. Um, it just came out about a month ago, and so far I really like it. It's definitely got a very interesting premise, um, and it's, it's a good, like, spooky October read if you're um, looking for something to read this month. If you like weird stories, this might be one that you like. I just wanted to show you the very first line here. Um, there's a bunch of new books that came out about a month ago and when I went to the bookstore to just like check them out, see if I wanted to read any of them, I flipped through and read the first paragraph of all of them and as soon as I read this line, I was like, yep, this is the one. This is the one I'm gonna read because look at this. Who starts a book like this? It is day nine of Vlogoween. This morning when I woke up, I was gonna do like all of these things. I was gonna go check out Fleet Week today, but um, I decided not to because I feel like I kind of just wanna hang out around the house today. Um, so I ordered some Indian food. I've got some butter chicken, naan, and kheer in there. Um, and then I made myself some coffee and I've just kind of been relaxing all day. And I don't know, that's kind of what I want to do. So I was watching this episode of Bob's Burgers this morning, the one where, um, I think it's in season three, where Bob like realizes that his own childhood was so, I guess, sucky. Like he realized that he didn't have a good childhood because he worked all the time. And um, so he like fires the kids and it's like, go like have a summer, go do this stuff. You know, and they're trying to have fun in like the traditional ways that are just like not working out and they're not as fun as they seem. Um, and they're just like, wow, there's just so much pressure to have fun um, now that it's the summer break. And I kind of felt that this morning where I felt like I should go do something. It's the weekend. I don't have any work to do. But I kind of just want to hang out at home and watch some like scary movies, watch Bob's Burgers, and just relax. So that's what I'm going to do today as well. And I'm not going to feel guilty. Um, I'm just taking it an hour at a time right now and that feels great. 
So I've got two candles burning right now and I wanted to show you which ones those were. Um, so this one is called Leaves um, by Bath & Body Works and it smells like, well I guess I don't need to show you the inside of the candle. Um, it smells like, uh, like apples and cloves and it's not too sweet, it doesn't have any cinnamon in it. I don't really like candles that smell like food. Um, I just like candles that smell like nature and the outdoors. And I feel like during this time of the year, a lot of the candles just smell like food. So there's a lot of pumpkin smelling candles and a lot of like apple cinnamon smelling candles and marshmallow smelling candles, but I don't really like them. And then this one is just called The Original by White Barn and I haven't actually seen it outside of the store that I got it on. Um, I tried to find it online, but I don't know if they make it anymore. But this one, the smell is really hard to describe. Um, it is really good, uh, but it kind of just smells like pepper, and like that's it. I'm sure there's other stuff in there because it doesn't just smell like pepper, but that seems to be the strongest. But yeah, so I like both of these. I've had these burning for about 30 minutes now, and my entire room already smells like both of them, and they all smell so good, and I feel so cozy already. It's a good 